Hello. In this video, I want to show you how to upgrade this 19 inch ELO touchscreen from CCFL to our newest UB60 series. This is a 19 inch uh, widescreen display. It's made by ELO Touch. Uh, the, uh, the model number is ET1900L. Again, ET1900L. Uh, this kit comes with the one LED drivers, wire harness, aluminum foil, and two of the LED strips. Okay, so let's set aside for a minute and we're going to crack this um, case open. All right, um, it's there's three screws which is I already took it out, so you need to take it out first. And after you take out the screen, you have to overlay this. Okay, use a flat tools, kind of like go around here. See this? This way, maybe it's a little better for you to see it. Okay, so go around this. Okay, now it's coming off, right? So, okay, oh, there's a tape. Okay, take it out, and then you see this two connectors. You just basically, this is for the controls and uh, for the speakers. Uh, there's a latch, you push it down, push it out. Latch. Push it down, push it out. Okay, let's set it aside. The back cover, start. So let's take a look at the chassis. This is an inverter, and uh, this is a whole bunch of screws. Some of them already removed, you see? This is a screw, screw, but uh, just to save time in this video. There's three screws on each side. Um, one, two, three, four sides. But before I do that, you're gonna Remove the cover of the inverter. All right, set that aside. Disconnect this inverter wire harness. Okay, set that aside. Okay, then we're going to disconnect this um, backlight wire harness. Just slowly, this is four lamps. Okay, done. Next thing, we're gonna try to uh, remove this touch interface, okay? Um, let's put it this way, a little easier for you to see it, okay? You see this? You gotta loosen up and make it a little bit longer before you uh, remove this one. Otherwise, it's gonna damage this wire, uh, ribbon wire and cable is gonna be damaged the touch interface. So just slowly peel it off. You can use, reuse it or use the new one either way. Okay now, it's then the long one, right? Then we're gonna remove all the screws on, on the four sides. As I said, some of them I already remove it. So I just need one on each side. Okay. The screws are a little bit smaller so I'm using a small Phillips. It's much easier. Okay, one here. Okay, so one more here. Okay, so let's see how we can do it. Leave it up like this. Okay, there's no connections, so we had to. Uh, just like this, lift up, be really careful. Okay, extend a little bit. You don't want to damage this. Okay. There's two screws that hold in on each side. Probably you can see it. And um, the screen, so we had to take out the screen first to access this connections, okay? So, one, two, Two, two more. The way I do it is a little bit using a little bit bigger cardboard and lay it on the top here. I'm gonna set it like this. You see that? So let me move it so you can see better. Okay. So leave it up a little bit uh, here, here. Just be careful of this cable. 
You don't want to damage it. All right. Okay. This side probably easy for you to see it. I'm gonna show you. You see the cable? Cable here. Okay, just pick it out. There's a latch. Be careful. Oh, see that? Took out already? Okay, so we're gonna set aside the screen first. Take out this cardboard. Okay. Um, I'm not sure you can see or not. Let me let me put it here. See that? It's right here. Actually you can get your hand in between. You just kind of like a Pull it out, just like this, okay? Now it's out, pull it out here. Okay, let's set it up here. Let's set it aside. 